A former Minister of Aviation, Stella Odua, has told the federal court seating in Abuja that she is in talks with the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission over the 7.6 billion naira fraud charge against her. The intention is to reach a plea bargain deal with the commission and avoid going to trial. Celestina area tells us more. This will be the seventh time arraignment of the former Minister of Aviation will be adjourned. Although today's proceedings were for the arraignment of the defendants, cancer to the first to ninth defendants pray the court to adjourn proceedings pending the outcome of an application before the EFCC. They inform the court of the application to the EFCC for an out-of-court settlement and they are expecting a response from the commission. Counsel to two companies that are also defendants in the case, James Onoja, told the court that over 95% of the money has been refunded to the government. Mr. Onoja noted that over 320 million naira have been refunded with an astounding 8 million naira. Counsel to the EFCC, Hassan Leman, acknowledged that the letter was written to the EFCC by one of the defendants for the matter to be compounded, but the EFCC is here to respond to the application. He prayed the court to go ahead with the arraignment, pending when the commission attends to the application of the defendants. Although over 320 million naira has been paid, the amount in question is over 7 billion naira. Presiding Judge Justice Ian Eko held that since the primary intent is for the federal government to recover its money and payments are already being made, he will give the prosecution and the defendants a few days to hold a conference. Parties are to report back to the court on 15th of June for a report on the conference and subsequent commencement of trial. Justice Echo said in open court that he has been getting calls from a particular number concerning this case. The alleged caller is not a party in the suit but has breached his privacy. He noted that the records of court are public documents that can be accessed. He says he will be giving the said number to the security agencies for appropriate measures to be taken. Celestina Iria, TVC News, Abuja.